Early this morning, I talked to Reverend uh, James uh, Xavier Palatau, who is the pastor of uh, the Lutheran Church in Mahayag, Albuera Leyte. And he told me that he has to travel to another province just so he can communicate and at the same time buy some of the immediate needs of his people. From him, I was able to learn that uh, the two congregations that he served, the churches or church buildings are damaged, one almost totally. The parsonage also is gone and the houses of the people in his area, including those of the majority of our members, are either totally damaged or significantly destroyed. I also talked to the president of the Mindanao district and uh, he assured me that uh, people, I mean pastors and uh, alert team of the Lutheran Church in the Philippines are on their way to the area and they have with them uh, a little amount that they can use to uh, by the immediate needs of not only the members of the church but the people in the community and uh, they said that the damage is really very uh, I would say significant meaning so many people are affected because these people live in the coastal area. The alert team uh, have also updates and they are working together with uh, the peop uh, Reverend Reyes who is the lead team including my vice president and they said uh, they reported the same thing that uh, almost all the homes of the members are totally damaged the two uh, actually the three church buildings are gone one totally flat flattened and uh, the pastor i have not communicated yet to that pastor in one of the in the Tacloban area but uh, I, I learned that uh, he is working hard to locate one of his members Although I was assured and told that uh, many of our members, almost all of them actually, are safe uh, except that their properties and their means of living are gone and destroyed.